Georgia Senator, well, U.S. Senator from Georgia, Johnny Isaacson, issued a challenge today to the Senate candidate who is questioning his health. Isaacson's up for re-election, and Channel 2's Lori Geary caught up with both candidates. And Isaacson told you, Lori, that he has no problem fulfilling his duties. There's so much attention on the presidential race this year. Lots of Georgia voters need a reminder there's another primary for local and state races. Senator Johnny Isaacson is facing two challengers in his own GOP primary. I've been in politics 42 years. Nothing bothers me. Georgia's Republican incumbent senator is well positioned in his race for re election. Millions of dollars in his campaign coffers, the only senator to chair two powerful committees and respected on both sides of the aisle. Johnny Isaacson will not finish. His six year term, and Nathan Deal will appoint his replacement if Johnny Isaacson is re elected again. Derek Grayson is one of Isaacson's Republican challengers and is using Isaacson's health to try and garner support. Last year, Isaacson announced he suffers from Parkinson's, but he also says it's not slowing him down. I got up at five this morning, went two miles. He can come join me tomorrow, and if he can make it as long as I can, then he can say whatever he wants to. I will go jog with him two miles. Grayson admitted to me his past mistake, telling me he's a convicted felon from more than 25 years ago, but was pardoned. Also running, Mary Kay Bacchio, a college professor who lives in Fayetteville. Political analyst Bill Crane says it would be tough to take out Isaacson. So, in someone like Johnny, who's been in public life since the 1970s. It's extremely difficult. Crane says it's clear voters are taking out their frustrations with Washington in the presidential race. So it's sort of like that. I hate the institution, Congress, but I love my guy or my woman. And I think, I think we're seeing that play out with most of the anger, if you will, being foisted at the president's race. Voters here in Georgia can head to the polls on May 24th. Reporting from Midtown Atlanta, Lori Geary, Channel 2 Action News.